still other challenges. And fortunately, Tswane City has plans, including the budget to deal with many of those that were said to be so that was what was pleasing that there are plans and there is a budget to deal with these challenges and people can relate to it because indeed they've seen uh, the delivery being done. So it has been pleasing. And, um, and, and you say there was a situation. Now, that's a point I've just made to the crowd here, that ANC is a democratic organization. Where there is democracy, there are always issues raised openly. And then people demonstrate their dissatisfaction. What is a test is whether the organization is able to deal with those matters. That is a test of democracy. And that's what we are doing. We have said to the people here, where there are complaints and concerns, even after the 3rd of August, the ANC will address those issues, as we have always done so. You know that at one time, there was Kosas and Azuma process, precisely because there were issues. I've never seen, I haven't heard with other parties. I don't even know what type of system they have. We have the least conference which is a culmination of the processes of the ANC. Certainly in democracy, there will be people who will be dissatisfied, but the capacity to address those by the ANC distinguishes the ANC from all other parties. So I'm very happy. I'm, I'm, I'm actually clear that Pretoria is safe in the hands of the ANC. No doubt about it. And, and I'm very happy I'm, I'm yeah. going away with understanding what Tswane is all about. So don't worry. This place belongs to the African National Congress. That's all. President, it would seem that they've even welcomed the mayoral candidates that seem Of course, of course, of course. Those are the benefits of the reality. People at times can go somewhere, but at the end they will come back home. Because they go to other organizations, they find the life is totally different. I'm sure you heard the one who spoke, who said, hey, white people are the only ones in the leadership there. We do the dirty work. So they felt that this is not what we know. Let us go back home, where we'll participate, where our participation is meaningful, is appreciated. This is the organization that has been there for 104 years. Who can compete with it really? With all the values, all the experience, it is in government, it is doing better all the time. So we are happy. I don't think people want to go to losing people. Okay. They want to go to people who win. Okay. African okay. National Congress. Okay. Mam Toko, you've also hit the ground running after your, the announcement of your nominations. How do you feel at the moment, given the fact that the president is also here to help a campaign for the ANC in terms of uh, trying to uh, grip, to, to, to hold your grip in, in the capital city? The president is our number one volunteer in the ANC. So he's here to do the work. He has been doing door-to-door, -door, strengthening the efforts that we've been undertaking in our election work here in Swane. So we're very happy that he has come to strengthen as he was in Kimberley yesterday and he's going to go to other provinces just to give them a boost. Do you think people were confused when they were calling you Juduza and you're not from here? <laughs> well, there are always exciting moments. You know, I've uh, found many jokes uh, that has been made. Even uh, Lion Match is now being named as quick and easy. ANC drops Togo in Twane and the city lights up. But those are lighter moments. What we have said as an ANC is that once the organization has taken a decision, all of us as cadres of the movement, we actually take forward and do what is necessary for all of us. I'm here as a cadre of the ANC. I live in Tswane, and I've got no fears that we'll be able to win Tswane as the ANC. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We have, we're still going to do door-to-door. -door. We're going to end up in Atlantic. Thank you.